Hey Drury, it's been a long time, but we're back. I know things are strange right now, but let's go see how people are feeling. So obviously 2020 has been different, but we're back on campus after five months, so how does it feel? It feels somewhat normal again. It's pretty weird. Yeah, it's definitely an experience. I actually feel like nothing has changed. I'm honestly so relieved to be back on campus. I miss my professors, especially Dr. Woods. Shout out to you. It feels really good to be able to see my friends and like coaches and teammates and be back in the groove again. I'll do whatever it takes to be in-person classes because I learn better that way. I'm really looking forward to my classes actually. It makes me sound like a nerd, but I'm excited to be here and be learning, so. That's the DU difference. We do this between every interview, don't you worry. Have you been anxious at all on campus? I honestly haven't been super anxious. I feel like we're taking the precautions we need to. It's just like what people choose to do with their time outside of class, that kind of has me a little anxious. I feel safe. I'm, I'm just overwhelmed with all of the new protocols. The thermometer in the cafeteria really gets me every time because in case I come in sweating, I'm scared. I think that there's plenty of measures in place in order for us to be safe. Uh, there's lots of hand sanitizers. Everybody has to wear the mask. Everybody's social distance, so I feel no anxiety at all. I'm, I'm, I feel safe. So do you feel like we're properly social distance? Um, scoot back a little bit. A little further. Okay, I think we're good. I love your mask. Who are you wearing? Oh, this old thing. I made this like three years ago, actually. You made it? Yeah, I did. Oh, we love DIY. If you could give one piece of advice for your friends for wearing masks, what would it be? To cover your nose and mouth. It's definitely something that we should do in order for this thing to be over quickly. Do it to protect others. Put your mask on. I'm kind of starting to like the smell. That's probably not good. Okay, fun question. If 2020 were an animal, what animal do you think it would be? That's a good question. Mm, that's a good question. These are some very strange questions. <laughs> Maybe like a snake, it just kind of like strangles you. Okay. If 2020 were an animal, what animal would it be? Ooh, probably a dead one. So have you seen a murder hornet? No. You haven't? No, have you? Did you see them on campus? Yeah, I haven't seen any on campus. Well, just if you walk right through there, there's several. Actually, are you being serious? Yeah, those like big, huge, like bee looking things. I saw one just a second ago over there. Yes. Walk through the path and you'll find several murder hornets. Do you think 2020 will ever end? No, it doesn't feel like it. <laughs> I mean, hopefully it does. It feels like it's the longest year ever. And it feels like with everything going on, like it, the, the negative things won't stop. But hopefully we have some, some good fortune coming our way. With the latter part of 2020 and all the turmoil and the uncertainty that it's brought, um, it will end. And I think um, as we like take steps to, to do so together, instead of making it a me situation, the ending might come a little bit quicker. 